Well, also in Macon tonight, the city is being recognized for its springtime beauty. 41 NBC's Cameron Branscombe hit the streets to see what makes Macon pop. The birds are chirping and the leaves have turned green. It's springtime in Macon. According to a study done by MyBaggage.com, TikTok ranked Macon the third best city to visit during springtime. I talked to a few people around the city just to see what makes Macon so great to visit. Macon has gathered 53.7 million views on the social media platform TikTok. As the weather continues to warm up, more people are expected to visit Macon. And people are excited to get out with the warmer temperatures. Um, we have incredible uh, medium parks throughout downtown, so they make the perfect spot to have a picnic or just come out and enjoy the sunshine um, as you're out and about exploring downtown. Sally Stone is visiting Macon after taking a break from a dog show she and her dog Sugar are competing in. Stone talked about some of the Macon attractions she has gotten around to. Went to the N Native American Mound, which was fascinating, I thought, and yesterday we went to the Tubman Museum, which I really loved and would love to go back to and spend more time at. Hawkins says this wave of TikTok fame is no coincidence. Her and the Newtown Macon team have been showing off what downtown has to offer on a TikTok page. We are showing off all the unique assets that we have, and we're really fortunate in downtown Macon that all of our businesses are local. They're locally owned and operated, and I think that makes our downtown experience unique to others. Vice President of Sales and Services for Visit Macon, Stephen Fulbright, says they appreciate what the Cherry Blossom Festival does for Macon. It exposes them to our great culture, to our food, to our restaurants, but also to our attractions and other events that are, that are going on in the city. So they'll come back and go to other things throughout the rest of the year, especially in the springtime because there's so many events in the spring. Stone had a lot of great things to say about Macon. Macon seems like a fabulous place to be. It's a place I'd like to spend more time. A lot of places to eat lunch outside, beautiful old buildings, obviously fabulous weather. It just seems like a cool city. In Macon, Cameron Branscombe, 41 NBC News. And there are two festivals coming up to enjoy here in Macon. One is the Pan-African Festival hosted by the Tubman Museum. And we have the Just Tapped Beer Festival. Both are later this month.